and we'll go live to the match. First pair is Barbeau from England making their seventh appearance in the competition. They have 15 World Bowls Tours titles between them. Please welcome out Greg Harlow and Nick Brett. <laughs> And their opponents, as previously mentioned, have won titles around the globe with 32 World Bowls Tour titles to their name. The four times winners and current World Indoor Pairs champions, please welcome out Paul Foster, MBE, and Alex Marshall, MBE. <laughs> Thanks, Rishi, and it will be a good one. I have no doubt about that. It's uh, four, arguably four of the very, very best players ever to play the indoor game. And we have to say, Rob, looking at the start of the event, you could see the draw and you're thinking it would be very tasty if these four come up in the final. Yeah, they're, so as you say, four of the best players that have played on this carpet and they're bound to put a show on for us this afternoon <coughs> with some top quality exhibition bowls. Jack Lintz, 28 and a half metres. I think the fact that all four of them have been so successful at this venue makes a big difference in many ways because if we're being truthful about it, you know, Alex Marshall has won almost everything there is in the game, very little he hasn't won. But well, you got um, when it comes to here, he just <coughs> seems to excel. Yeah, he's very comfortable at this venue um, in all disciplines. Well, Greg has been very successful before in different venues in Wales and Scotland and in uh, Sheffield when we, when we used to have a, an event there, as was Paul around all the venues and indeed Nicky. But well, start, uh, when it comes to Potters, really start here. it's, it's Paul. really where uh, Alex well, Marshall is, is the man to put down. disturbance with Greg Harlow. No shot clock of course in the pairs and because this is a final I expect there'll be a lot of uh, discussion and three ball pairs, there's a lot more tactics involved. <coughs> yeah, run all you got again. Run. Again, mate. Yeah, not so bad, mate. Only that. Early opportunity, Rob, to put you uh, on the fence, or whether you're going to leap one side or the other. Not too bad again here. Oh, not too bad be. again. I mean, you can't call these games. Game. I mean, the quality of the players out ball. there. A lot of it will come down to the runners really in connections and results on the runners. Uh, but you, you'd love to see a tie break going into this game as a neutral. Yes, it's one of those games where a little bit of luck could make all the difference. Right back, right back in your and in this sport, it can be very cruel on occasions. <clears throat> Touching your last is good. <clears throat> Fraction rider. I know. Oh, you've got. Yeah, this is coming to a good spot here. Up yet, Paul. Up yet. <laughs> Keep running. That's good. No <laughs> That's a very good start, Paul Foster. Three balls in. 
and get them all within it. I think Nick might be tempted score. straight away down the four hand pace. <coughs> Three red. Yes, the front green ball doesn't really help that shot. It's wide enough to get into the target. I just wonder, first ball at first end, would he really want to play in early? Or would he just try and drop off the back ball? Both shots have got their difficulties. <coughs> Look to the side there. Just a touch up, mate. Lime's good. The lane's good, mate. Come on. What are you? Not much, mate. Uh, 20 inches. Well, it's not in the way, but it's not going to help. Lovely. Yeah, uh, you've gone to me. Great line. Gently, mate. Gently. Gently. Just a touch. Great try. Just slightly over the weight. Just doesn't get back. 18 inches, mate. Or at least it gets back, but not in time. Chance for Alex here to put some big pressure on the first end. Slight increase on his last. Ah, very good to you, mate. Well, Paul thinks it's very good. Um, it must be very close to the jack. That's what Nick was looking for. Touch off the back ball. Maybe a case of one in, one out, but it's a much better first shot. Narrows the head right down. Off, They're in bother here. Not an easy one to get out of. Well, that's why I thought Nick might have been tempted early. Just to just potentially open it up. Perfect on the draw. If you get the outside of the bowl, it's still going to be three down. <laughs> There's three in it, but um, not convinced it will help them if the jack goes out onto the respot because they're he's pushing the red balls with the jack. All on connections now. Let's get the front green. He's good. Unlucky, mate. That was the front ball I was talking about earlier, Rob. It was, wasn't really in the way. He was just going a bit narrow, but he was only half a ball away from getting it perfect. And this is going to hurt on the first end. Just move that jack an inch or so, and you're picking up a five. Yes, that's a bonus. Get this one into camp. If he does get a little touch on it, that's, a, that's just a, a Brucey bonus for the first end. Brucey bonus. You're showing your age. Fucking higher. Run now. Come on. Run. Don't think so. It just seemed to drop a little bit. Close though. Three, three, three. Take three, yeah. Next one's green. Yeah, good. Three shots, Foster and Marshall. <laughs> Players are very good about asking the, the markers at World Bowls to level what they are, what they think, because they're usually very, very good. Set score three one after the first end. Can't be measured, of course, but uh, they're usually very accurate. Twenty nine meters. Not 
Een paar meer. Nog een beetje. Dan je. Nee, nog een Just Paul not Foster, much for weight. Prolific winner of titles indoors and outdoors. Member of the World Championship team coming up for May in Broad Beach. On the Gold Coast. So we'll be going back there after being there in the Commonwealth Games in 2018. Where again he was very successful. Greg Harlow doesn't play outdoors, and, uh, so he misses out on all those. But I don't think he misses out on too many trips, though, considering where he works. All we got, mate. All we got, Paul. I'll play to you. Once again. Up a bit further. Yeah, move on. Good. Mike Marshall. Also part of that World Championship team. Again, many titles, Commonwealth Games and various other events. And yet. Yeah. yeah, decent. Well done. Well done. Yeah, up. It's a shot. It has. Yeah. That was the voice of Nick Brett. Well, Nick Brett's back Ten into inches. the England setup. Rob, as you well know. Yeah, fully deserved. I mean, Nick is a fantastic player. I mean, he's proven that time and time again. As I say, he's back in the, the fold. And he's got his first trip as well um, in the elite level. He's off to Nothing Australia off as well with the, with the world team for England. We've been lucky here. That's a good spot, though. That's good. That's a ball, with it, just mate. in case it's trailed. Way. And you're not there just to carry the bags, are you? Hopefully not. Hopefully I, I do a bit better than that. Um, but yeah, all <coughs> looking forward to it. Good team. Yeah, good yeah, England team. Very yeah. strong. A new new manager in charge, um, so things will will change. Well played. Slightly. He'll put his, his little twist on things, which is all good. A bit of freshen, freshen things up. Well done. And another good ball from Greg. Bit of a target if necessary, but uh, Too green. interesting to see if Alex just draws this. He's so confident here that you really do wonder does he even need to play a weight shot at it. It's Diane, arrived in last night. The man that travels up and down the southern hemisphere so much. Just going to go big tournaments down in Australia. How are you? Good effort, mate. Great was great. Good effort, one. Too much, I think. Okay. Might look at the forehand right. runner now. The two yeah. green Wish balls are disappearing. Spotted. Or if he just wants to put a foot on, he can just turn the jack with a good draw. Be well hidden. Sticking with the draw. Mm. Just gonna go in there. Stay up. And ball Tuck. just staying on Stay a line. Up. Now it has to arrive. Stay up. Touch will do. Very good, mate. Oh, very close. Probably second shot. Don't think it's a number one. Probably made the one down, mate. Got uh, green plant up here. Yeah, the green green plant is the best result. Interesting. Greg said it's one. He fancies it's one down. So that's worked out really well. Wasn't what he was after. Very slightly off target. Not much, just half a ball. Yeah, certainly a maximum result there for Nick. So he wasn't far off target. Okay. 
three green. time on the ring comes to play come on for a second then yep. to memorize what the weight is he Very wants on for second good shot job. yep that's one good we will be tempted of the one mate well you say rob and say he's tempted will he take the ball off he can afford to take his own off as well but either side and still score one or two but also draw another shot. Yep, sticking to the draw. <coughs> Hard luck. Hard luck, mate. Yep, just caught. On hold. No damage done, though. <coughs> One shot, hollow and bread. Set score three one after two ends. So minimum requirement, 23 meters. It's Mike Davies out there as the umpire. Helping Francis Fletcher. Has he made it? Front edge of the mat, front edge of the jack. It's good. Imagine it was by much, though. We can <coughs> safely be assured that it's a 23 meter jack length when they have the tape out. It's only just up. Shorter distance, Rob, but it's, <laughs> it's actually very difficult. Yeah, I mean, the, the turn's still there. It's so it's just that little bit of weight adjustment. Paul and Alex have obviously gone T to T. So a drastic change from from Greg. Good start, Paul. Great start again. Well played. And this is well so the almost default <laughs> distance for Paul Foster and Alex Marshall when they're playing singles. Again, who you've got? Yeah, well done, well done. Come again, Paul. Touch up. Yeah. That's okay. It's going, going to yap. <coughs> Run yet. Run. Drop that, mate. Sorry, bud. Right. Yeah, this one's just dropping. Just here, Greg. Saying sorry. They're all mic'd up, of course, and you will get that interaction between the players. And it's always interesting to hear what they're saying. Easy. Oh, a little touch. Just over. He's absolutely yeah, right. You would expect. Okay. Yeah. One red. Both players realised that was just falling through, but it's a good Sorry. position, Wait, yeah, it's a receiving okay. position. <coughs> Doing 
much. Yep. Good try, mate. Next time. Run, mate. Up yet? Yeah. yeah, good. Not much at all. Could be tempted be now, one. Nick. Yeah, I'm going to say still draw one away. down, but it's made the draw very difficult, buddy. Yeah. yeah I think he'll be, be through this. Oh, play. Oh, and what a result. Wow. I thought they had to go out into a respot, but he jammed it, and it's just travelled to the green ball. Brilliant hit. Uh, no, quarter ball behind. Doesn't often happen. No, as we were saying earlier, it could be. Yes, that could be crucial. Definitely. Or will he be crucial in this game. Well. Results like that. Alex will be playing similar down the other probably. It, it was a lovely clean hit, though. It was absolutely spot on. But I think, uh, nine times out of ten, or even more, it would have disappeared. Oh. Oh. No, Alex, are you inside the red oh. one? If you are, you've got it. Yep, that's enough. Just this is good stuff. Now we're seeing the top class that stuff. That we expected. Ball, mate. Yep. Conversion shots, draw shots, full drives. Crush a ball for Nick here. Too much turn he gets now. It should get back most of it. He's trying to handle this one. And that's going to drop as well. Oh, yes. That's yeah. a good it really is. After a full drive, it's a good shot. What? One degree. Change. Yes. Alex's shot now again. Got the two deepest. Quicker than last time. Well, he might need to if he's going to get to the jack or the ball. Last one was a nice timer. This one might need to go a bit straighter. Yep. All right. Oh, pull it. Oof, my goodness, maybe that wasn't far away. What? One shot, hollow and breath. It would have been fortunate, but could easily have happened. Good morning. Okay. Set score 3 2 after three ends. Jack length 26 and a half metres. <coughs> I'm back. Tastes good. One now, mate. It's gonna be touch. Eighteen inches. <coughs> yeah, well done. Well done, decent. <clears throat> we 
way back. All the way back, Paul. All the way back. Down you. Yep, yeah, show him, mate. Come on. Good stuff, isn't it? Yeah, so it's what expected, really. So, a load of players up the top watching. You've got Stuart on up the top there, who's obviously on next. His players partner, Darren. Scottish intention, wasn't uh, Mike Stepney <coughs> up there as well? Yeah, yep. be there, mate. Yeah, okay. Man from Elgin. <coughs> Same shot, Paul. I'm not sure where that is. You just so on your own, leaving again, Downey the Greggs, second one. Beautiful part of the UK. Touch up. One of the a fraction high. Fraction high. We'll come round it then. He wants to get a round clean about. road past That's it. Fine. And he That's has. Good. That's Not a very it. useful ball. Yeah. 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 One road. Just up, I think. Just here, mate, yeah. Not a lot. Alex might be thinking he can trail this jack a little bit. Yeah, having a wee look here. Very good, Not mate. Far away. Yeah. So he's a touch now, it's really good. Slight touch, makes the two though. What are you thinking? <laughs> Too many people listening for that. But yeah. yeah. <laughs> Probably quicker head down this. here just to try yeah, and Yeah, 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 with this one, mate, definitely. <clears throat> turned over, so he's going to be going quick down the fort. Side of his own, it could be good. Well done, mate. One away. That's good. Yeah, and he's got the best back all night. Yes. I'd play the same shot, mate. You touch it, you make three. <clears throat> down. Get down. Not a good bit. Lovely bit, actually, turn the jump for three or four okay. shots, but catches the ball to make it two. Two red. Not the ease of heads here for Nick either. I think he's got to be probably firm through again. Edge of the red bowl is not good. So there's a risk involved here if he gets it wrong. Well, at least one, but give him a chance for another one. Right, the, the difficulty, Rob, is if, if he gets into here instead of the jack, what's going to happen with these two balls here? You know, they could easily disappear. Now, if the ideal result would be to get to the jack and bounce it off the ring because the respot position's here, and that brings the green ball being key. And that would be the shot. Well, going again. It's in the area. Hurry for the jack. Like Great shot. Well played, buddy. Is it staying on well the ring? Yeah, yeah. And he's well sat on top of it as well. He's got it in the ditch. It didn't go off the ring. And not only that, as you say, Rob, he's right in with it. He's turned that into three shots. Courageous. Courage and talent to play that. Mm. 
This isn't easy for Alex because the forehand, as you were explaining to me before, Rob, it's going to be very hard to hold the ball up. Yeah, Matt's up three or four, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Um, That's one here. Tight to get shot. I think just just make sure, guarantee second. Well, even it's going to be very hard to even get to that because of. Ball in the ditch is, well, you more or less forget about that one because that's probably going to be the shot anyway. But it's the one in front. Just hard enough to beat it. Goodness me, this is going out. <laughs> well, they couldn't go any wider. It's all about weight now. Oh, he's played it. What a great ball. <laughs> oh, it's, uh, and told again to push it out that way. Yeah, so there was never One any shot issue with him that second, but he was, gave it a chance. Set score, score. 3 3 after 4 in. Oh. So Nick and Greg are certainly fighting to keep in this at the moment. Alex and Paul will probably come out slightly better, but Nicky's runners have been spot on at the moment. Jack, length 26 metres. Decent starter. Well done. Well done. <clears throat> Very good, mate. There you are. Yeah, shot in. Well done. Just that little bit. It's the sort of game that you want to be playing in, Rob, if you're playing well. Yeah, definitely. Um, but say when, when you've got players right out there playing own. well, it, right down it makes you own. perform as well, generally. Um, right so being a world final, these guys know what it's about, so they're not str strangers to it. Um, like it. And that's where they generally produce the best goals. Ideally, just setting that last one. Yeah, so the thing about the pairs is you really want to perform because you've got someone with you. You'd want to let them down. Yet, man. If you're not playing well, not yet. Uh, keep running. Probably wish you were watching. Yeah, 14 inches. Very similar. Get to your own. Get a piece. It'll be real nice. Up you come. And again. Up you come. 14 inches, mate, is good. That's the chance for the trail. Just giving Paul Foster an opportunity to get to the green balls just behind the jack. All the way back, Paul. All the way back. Down just well. over. Just up, mate. Yeah. Great try. Good effort. Let's see what he was looking for. Halfway through this first set. One red. When it was two ball pairs, we used to play the 11 ends, but with the three balls being pulled back to nine. In each set. But uh, three balls. Two nines and a three and tie break, 21 ends effectively available. It's usually enough to separate the pairs. Play, Nick. Play, buddy.
Yeah. Great effort, mate. Time again. Get down to his, his bowl and drop just in front. That'll make things really awkward for Alex. Come in the same direction, it's about the only thing the same. Okay. <laughs> A fraction of green or six inches further. I was watching them practice before the match. And there's 10, 12 balls within half a yard, two feet, and you sort of knew that the, all four players were finding their line, the length. The weight of the, the rink. Still there, mate. Draw away. Solid drop, really good. Got it really well. Took that meter show off. Hi, mate. That's Alex and a little bit of problem here. Well, ball on the jack would be good, but it's the front red one's the problem. You have to negotiate your way past that. Too green. Not a lot available in the forehand. It's all very narrow looking. Green bowl is probably his best result. Green bowl in the front. Yes. I'm going to get that as well. Yep. Interesting here. That's a very tough shot to get up around the, the red ball and nudge the green ball onto the jack. There's a forehand runner, but he has to get absolutely everything perfect. It'll be, it'll be quick through the four. Oh, has he got it? Oh, I thought he'd got a brilliant result out of that. But his own ball came through and hit the jack. Two shots, hollow and Brett. Hit so many balls on the way through, you couldn't keep control Chesco of it. Three five after five ends. You just have no idea whenever you hit the jack like that, but the follow through. Good strike, but no change on the score. Still two down. Jack ends twenty five meters. Right start, hold on. Oh. Not bad. Not too bad here, mate. Yeah, it's a good start again. No play. No done. Can do if you want. Yours is half to you. Right back now, you've got a chance. Weight's good enough for it. Green ones up, drag, drag high. What do you want? I'd probably go there, mate. Try and get that first. Paul looking to get to the two green balls if he can. 
If he's just inside, yep. drop on his own or yep. turn the jack. Not too bad, Paul. Not too bad at all. In the area. Oh, that's a hit. Oh, didn't go far enough. Mm, he's framed the jack. I think. I think. Looks too Greg good. Could to be turn tempted. Down. You pick your pace, really. Yeah. It look better. He's been giving the OK from hand. Nick. Whatever you, you pick, whichever, mate. It's fine. I think this will be a forehand runner. It looks like he's on the backhand. Well, Red gives him another angle off the backhand, I suppose. Back into the jack as well. Oh. And he's using the ball. And instead of coming onto the jack, took the other ball out. Always a possibility, always in the area. Such a big target. Yeah, this is good stuff, Paul. Brilliant. Very good. Brilliant, mate. Well done. Just put it straight back. Great shot. Always nice whenever you see a ball disappear and you bang another one in. One mate has got to be the forehand though. Just right the, sorry? Well, the last ball's five inches short. So I just draw round about it just now. A little bit wary of the forehand. Just want to turn the green ball in towards the jack. So hard route on the backhand, but uh, if he is wide, it's much safer. Yep, that's his hand it. All the way back. Yeah, Nick could be tempted now to turn over. Okay, mate. Turn the jack round the corner, even getting in the split top edge of the, the green. Just try and see if I can spawn one off the side. Yeah, there's, yeah, you no, know, no, no, no. draw it in. There's a good good chance off that one. That's just what Greg's explained as well, Rob. More chances on the forehand now. <laughs> mm. yeah, he's interested. Not quite getting Get down, down. for him. Uh, I've been back, back again, it's good. There you go. Checking the score in the ends. It's going to be putting, putting Nick and Greg in a bit of a situation, eh? Well, he's more or less saying if you're too heavy, you're going to lose a bundle because the ball's on the jack. But also, he's saying if you don't play it, I might. I think they're going to have to play for cover here, Rob. You know, it's you've been out there, you know the situation. Um, it's a sort of shot. That they could have almost afforded to take on to that spot. That's covered as much as possible. You have to assume that someone of the quality of Alex Marshall is going to get the shot. Yeah. You have to cover it. Going back towards the tee. Well done, Nick. Well done. Very good. Very good.
Force Alex into the, back into the draw now. Such a tight game, he won't take the risk anyway, but... Yeah. Not easy to add another one. Difficult link for it, like <laughs> Any other link for you. Yeah. You'd Good try, mate. You'd be there, wouldn't you? Only two feet. One shot, Foster and Marshall. <laughs> Set score, 4-5 after six ends. Jack wins 24 and a half metres. Good mate. Well played. Well played, Paul. Good. So we're getting to a crucial point in this set now. Seven, a couple ends from the end after this one. And back. It's a great shot. Perfect. Craig. Great shot. Hey, yeah, mate. Good shot, Jack Kai. A chance. Got a chance. Got a big chance. Oh. It's close. It's just past any touch is real good for us. Well, for our viewers in Northern Ireland who are leaving us, you can join us on BBC iPlayer, BBC Sport app, and the BBC Sport website. So a variety of ways to well keep done. watching well this done. very interesting final. Join us there. We, we might be one down, but well, thanks for yeah. 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 touching yourself. Seventh end of the, yep. any nine end set. So important, the team that's behind really needs to score. And we're not quite sure just who's lying the shot. Uh, extremely tied up there, but all the positions certainly with Nick and Greg at the moment. Three bowls just passed. Some effort here, mate. What an effort. Run. Down, then, down, down. Yep. Helps. Oh, is that closer again? Hmm. Still draw to the, draw to the shot ball. Yeah, it's still the same measure, mate. So 
The gap's about six inches between the two bowls, so there is just room. Well, the way Greg asked him to play that, you'd think he was three feet away from it. Call it these guys, you wouldn't expect him to miss either, to be honest. Well, he's very close to splitting the two red balls and getting to the jack. That's what the target is. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is ridiculous. That is just so good. It is ridiculous. What a ball. Oh. And he may not get the opportunity to enjoy it because Alex Marshall will be hitting it. I'm sure he'll be playing with weight into this, but that was outrageous. Play quick, mate. Back your side. Of course it does. Yep. <clears throat> I think even Nick was pretty pleased with that. I, one, I, think, he, I think he would be, yes. I don't think this one will be short. I think no. This will be a full out. Just uh, pick your weight. OK, 31, mate. Got one, and he's still left that plant to take the ball out. That depends on the back position, though. Back end draw. Still, yeah, still the one, mate. Back end draw. Drop. Oh, is he going to get the ball? Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh my goodness me! You were thinking the same as me. Well, we get some of this jack. They'll give a shot away. He's left other than in trouble. But there's no back position here for the red team. So what does he do? Yeah, it's, it's not like not a good head for Paul and Alex, but I think they've got to ride through it. To be fair, that's two brilliant balls, pink neck Brett. Forehand then backhand. Get to it. I just see what he does here. This is not easy because that back position. Okay, must be drawing. Mm. I think if he realised that the jack was to go through, he could be even more shots down. So trying to close it. He can. Perfect. I might be tempted to take these. Oh, I'm aware of you. He's playing with such confidence. And declared two shots, Harlow and Brett. Yeah. Two. It's that sort of game, isn't it? Too tight. Set score 4 7 after seven ends. Could you not look a dog like that? Hey, look at that. And a little pat as well. Wonderful. Jack, it's 28 metres. It's funny when you show a dog, you always get a wee ah, don't you? But you don't get an ooh. You don't get an ooh, you get an ah. Right back now. And again. And again. And again. Well done. Just trying to find that first bowl again now. Well done, okay. Get us get the shot in this set uh, this end. It puts definitely puts him in the big driving seat. Going to the last end of the first set. Hope you come. Up you, mate. Keep running. Oh, just a little bit. Two feet. Oh, well, I, I, if you don't want to, you don't need to, because that's right on the run for touching in. It's up to you. 
I think you've made it well, I'd just stick with it. And again, and again, and again. What about the other mate? Just add, add two feet on your last. Just try and sneak inside the green, even just dropping round the outside of it. Okay there. <coughs> Similar. You can find six inches, that's perfect, just to get to this and sit. Come on. Come on. Come on. The green and drops is both is absolutely perfect. It's going to be tough here. Run at that. Try and get it's into this. It's a good heavy runner. Even if you get the outside of that, it's going to go into the jack. Getting inside is good as well. Even yeah, if you do clear your own front one, one away is good. The front one. So you're allowing the ball to draw back so he's on the outside of the mat. Try and help it. Up. Oh. Oh. Half and nothing. Up, up, up. That's all right. <coughs> it is all right. Okay. He's cleared that front ball away. Let Alex get at it. Oh. But he was only a couple of inches away from getting it perfect. Yeah, I'm just looking where. Yeah. Well, less than that. Yeah. It does help, though. Gives Alex more of a target there now. Moving the front. Nick probably draw into the spot. Yeah, you're happy. Off the four. <coughs> Julie Forrest. Cameron. Just, uh, Looking up on the other side of the stands, that's where a lot of the players have a tendency to, to stand and watch or maybe grab a seat. Uh, they've moved the spot. Women's match play, current champion, of course, through to the semi final this year. Okay, mate. Really okay. Wanted to miss. Don't like him. He wanted. Would have punched onto the jack. Was my weight okay? I th yeah, I might have been slightly over, but it wasn't too far away, mate. Similar. Similar, but better, you mean? Well. Still looking to get behind, but uh, can he miss his own? Just. Yep. And then Stop going a very good place. Yes. He was better that time, but there. that seemed to straighten not, up a little bit. I don't think even with mine. Touch quicker, a bit firmer with that one. Not straight down the same line. Pretty much past the bolt. Yeah. See, it just went three meters out. It just seemed to. Probably his own bloody thing. Just, it didn't continue on its bend. It just seemed to take a little kick. All right, I just got about that height. I yeah, I would rather see five then. Flash was confused. So I reckon he thought that was good. Hold. Yeah. Got 
one more ball to save the set. Surely Nick will stay away from this. He's trying to win that spot. Touch actually probably helped him to be honest with the right hand might have been a little bit heavier. <coughs> yep. It gives him the spot. Yeah. But again, it's only one and there's three against Mind that look difficult. Alex Marshall at the moment. I think he just has to play this again and hope for a good result. Yeah. There's not many good results there at the moment. The inside edge, yes, but he's got to play it with less pace now, which is hard. Mm. Yeah, at least I did get the pace with him. Needs the outside green almost solid. And just stun off it. Let's play this with a lot less weight. Try and make the split if oh. he can. Just struggles to get back though. Just half the ball out. Three shots, Harlow and Brett. Set score. Four ten after eight ends. Well, that's the set more or less gone. You can obviously, score a maximum of six, but in a, in a game like this, that's not going to happen. Jack Lynn, 24 and a half meters. Great right start, well done, well done. Best chance of a six now. Well done. That's just what it was. You're playing well. Those are the things that happen. Can't get much better lead than that. Too bad again. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, bring it out. Oh, that's a pity. It doesn't make any difference. It is a pity it's coming out. Chance before that.
played, Nick. Well done, mate. Well played. Very good. Very good, mate. Fine again, mate. Go another ring. Light and heck. Well done. Well done, mate. Well done. Very good. Yep. Well done. Yep. Yep. Mm, it's a closing down situation, isn't it? Almost just going through motions at the moment. Then you get it. Three bike. And again, mate. Throw another one in. The boys know what the situation is. That's why they're just drawing away. Just a bit of practice for the next set. Well done. Well played, Nick. Well played. Well done. Well done, mate. Well done. Now they're looking at Houdini shots. And there's really no point in me even trying to draw anything here because if they're going to get six out of this, I can't possibly see how. Might be a bit of a practice, might be a hit and hope shot, but to be honest with you, I'm not even sure it's worth that, Rob. No. Keep your weight in the arm, draw again. Yeah. The guys realise that there was no chance in this end, and they've used it as a practice drawing end. Very sensible, very professional about it. Drawing another shot. Two shots, Foster and Marshall, first set, Harlow and Brett. Long, long. So Alex Marshall there indicating to Paul Foster he wanted a long jack length. Really good set of balls, Rob, but I think you know Paul Foster started Jack off just getting the better features. of Greg Harlow and then Greg really come on strong. Yeah. Um, early doors, Nicky Blaze and great runners. Uh, got a couple of really good results as well. Um, and they just drew strength to strength in that set. Greg came onto a great game and just built head after head for Nicky. <coughs> Deserved to win the set. Paul and Alex will come back hard in this. In the second set. Well, you look at their record. Played each other twice, one each. And uh, when you look at the titles, Nicky and Greg have won it once before. Paul and Alex four times. Matches played for Greg and Nicky, 19 of 111. Well played. Paul Foster and well Alex played. Marshall. 36 matches played together and have won 25 of them. So, a uh, good hit rate. Hurry. Hurry, yeah. Hurry, Just a little bit, mate. 18 inches. Still get to your own. Down. Down to your own. Down. 
Yeah. Well done. Very good. Good effort. Good try, mate. Yep. Just wants to drop on the ball and roll back. Try. Pull out your last. There's been some discussion with the introduction of the three balls. Rob, whether it works or not, it's, it's run at Commonwealth Games level and various other things. We have a three-ball league back home. It works very well. It's an exciting league. Yeah, I think three-ball pairs is good um, in general. There's on here. There's all pros and cons. Same with everything, really. Um, it's certainly better, I think, for the crowd-wise. Um, we see a lot more shots played. And um, in general, better bowls having that extra bowl. Yes, tactically, it's, it's a different game. No doubt about that potential of picking up you know, you know, five shots or something or full house of six most unusual of course at this level but um, having said that it's still a reasonably quick game what effort this is stay up oh, just drifting try mate it's great Roar. yes mate yep Just a touch of green. Turn it over. Yeah, nothing for us there now, mate. My bowl, two feet. Well done, mate. That's not a silly finish there. Well done. Couple of feet. Max hasn't got the, the easiest of shots now. His last ball was blocking the, a good road in. Not a lot on, mate. Problem is to get inside. We're going to have to use a bit of weight, Rob, and uh, that might just push the jack out too far. Mm -hmm. I think what Alex is looking at here is um, if, if he comes in on the high side, which he might, or sorry, on the, uh, the low side of that ball, but the high side of the jack, and if he gets it, the problem is it's likely to go over that direction, and that's just not a, a he really doesn't need that because you're going to be, well, you're going to be a shot down, but the bigger problem is what Nick does with his next ball, he could add another. One shot's not a disaster, so uh, he's not been too adventurous to this. He's going to go off. Great effort, always just go on there with that effort. sort of weight. Yeah. If he was to move the jack, it would have to have been played with another three or four, maybe even five yards of, of pace.
One the shot, hard over his breath. Set score, zero one after the first end. Shot to nothing, really. You know, it was a, it was a tough one, there's no doubt about that. Certainly playing some bowls at the moment, Nick. Jack length, 25 and a half metres. Yes, playing well in the mixed pairs too. And he's definitely one of the uh, one of the favourites for the singles title, along with so many others. Great start. And up. And up. And again, and again, right up, right up, come on, and again. Get much but better. He's definitely up to the ball into the, jack. the first two or three ends was uh, a little bit on the loose side, but after that, he's been mate. absolutely terrific. Oh, oh, past the front. Well, again, he's just clipping the short ball, but he has opened the door. Yeah, so after the first two or three ends, it's been absolutely relentless from Greg and Nick. And Alex and Paul under all sorts of trouble. Hurry on. He's virtually bang on it the last time, mate. Hurry. Hurry. You kick it. Can you hit your wife? Sorry. They might go quicker this time. Yeah, good. Well done. So it's fishing to go on to the respot. Good. It'll be a drawing game between the two skips. That's live, yeah. It's the thing with Nick being such a quick player, and you have to have time to to put the markers up and check the touching balls in the ditch and put the jack back on the respot. A lot to be done before the player plays his ball. is often enough, although he's pretty good, Nick, that way. Just gets on with it, but it's in your eye line, it's a nuisance. Great ride, mate. Next time. Yeah, yeah, decent start, mate. Up yet. Yeah. Oh, how's he put the extra on? It's in the further. Right there. 
And that's more than decent. It's hard enough to beat. 18 inches gets you the shot. Oh, whoa! I'll play me. First time. <laughs> so, man. Both players making the adjustment after their first goals. Come on, top. Oh! Good effort, mate. Good effort. Fuck. One shot, Foster and Marshall. And they've just got away. Pretty really slow up there. You can see that, yeah. It's about the only point on the carpet there. Set score 1 1 after two ends. Too many people still willing to call the result of this game? No, not all. It's so go no. either way. Um, so you'd like oh, like oh, the tiebreak for a neutral? <laughs> it's always fun to see and to watch. But track length 29 metres. Just in the kid, he was a bit wide, he absolutely was. But uh, a ball narrower will bring that right back in again. Yeah, let's take it. Up now, up a bit longer. Yeah, well done. Good. There he is. Up. He's great, mate. Cut the feet, plenty. Won that again, I think. Yeah, well done. Good. Interesting change for all the Scott Spurs decided to go long. Yeah, well, there. Well known for the short jack length, but, uh, and they're all using balls that are just a, maybe a little bit on the inside sure line of, there, of the normal good. ones. Maybe you could explain to our, just our viewers why you're using a slightly tighter ball. Yeah, three are. Um, Paul's still using a, a wide swinging ball. Yeah. He generally does on here. 
and plays really well with them. Um, just the way the carpet's playing at the moment, it's quite quick and bendy. Um, all the players have just gone slightly straighter. Still using good turning bowls. Just ones on those inside lines. Sorry, Sorry about that. No. Sorry. Two red. So the longer jack length has worked, there's no doubt about that. A bit of a loose head, but it's three red. Indicators indicating that it's two, but we think it's three. What you get? <coughs> yeah, decent start, mate. Well done. Eighty inches. One way or another, it's definitely three now. Oh, there we go. Just pops out like magic. Little graphics packet. Just push through it, I think. Good try, mate. Good try. I'm trying to put a little bit more pressure on here again. Well played to him, mate. Well played, Tart. Just easy now, easy now, easy now. Oh. Inside. One foot, mate. There's still plenty of room. Go on, mate. Yep. Find a bit. Yes. Yes, bad. Yep. Okay, you do it. Well, I just think that one really had to be. Okay. Had to be there, Rob, didn't it? Yeah, a bit of a unexpected let off, really. Nick and Greg, I mean, if Alex had played the perfect bowl, a little touch was making four or five. Slight adjustment here from Nick. Away, didn't get the ball quick enough. One shot, Foster and Marshall. So, not a lot of damage done. Set score 2 1 after three ends. Just the one shot. Morgan. Length 29 yeah. and a half. <laughs> off, off. My second one is what they are. I'm still, still seeing him. He's trying to drop a bit. Mm. Mm.
Might be it. Uh, just two and a half. Right back now. Right back. Decent, 18. <laughs> feel like they're very relaxed right there, but there's the odd end coming up Sailing. now. Selling. Selling. Well played. Well Wish played. Tighten things up a bit. <laughs> well, it's just looking to string a few ends together now. That's what Nicky and Greg did in the okay. first set. Sorry. All right. Oh dear. It's a wayward end. Run, run all you got. And again, and again. Sorry, man. Sorry, Tom. Sorry about that. One green. Certainly yep. Paul's interested. Right to be as well. Time it. Okay, mate, next one. You're just out, mate, which is pretty decent. Oh, it's, in the it's a little bit heavy. Come on, Need to get to the edge of the ball, drop away from it. Locked on it. Go for him. Go for him, mate. Great guy. Hold tight. Yes. Great guy. Quite a couple of ends, Robert. It's been more a matter of uh, draw, draw, draw. Yeah, just. Not bad bowls, but just a little bit looser than we've seen so far in the game. <coughs> the carpet might have changed slightly. Oh, why do you think 
I'll just stop it. Lock it. Real good look at that, Greg. Close for the second. To run. Oh, he made it. Oh, it's going to drop as well. Oh, well, that could be another measure. Get the thumbs up. Now, I don't think I need that one. Could be one, two, or oh, three. Right. I'm going to guess. Two. I think was for that side. One green measure for second and or third. Red ball against the two green. Not the easiest to get up though. Hey, got that. Still think it's two green. Come on, Mike. Prove me right. There we go. Two shots, hollow and Brett. Quicker and more accurate than VAR. Even on a tricky measure. We don't have to worry about an elbow off and, or a, a, an ankle offside, do we? Set score, one three after four ends. Chat lens, 28 meters. Paul. Stay up yet. Up yet. Yeah, good start. Well done. Good play. Suddenly we're back to normal, Rob. Yeah, so it's more than that. Used to. Just behind. The final so far. Oh, I'm going back, I suppose. A chance, Paul. Just a fraction. It was really good. Same ball, probably best for you doing it rather than them, so. I've not been playing for an hour and 40 minutes, so. Very hard to keep top class balls during that time, every single right end. To us. And again, and again. A couple of ends have been just a little bit loose, but right. you know, having said that, there's been a massive, fantastic ball we'll in get this game, now. and that's what we want to see. Best players in the indoor game in the world out there, so we want to see them play. Nah, I, would, I would take a chance. You know, you'd be very unlucky to get half of your own and not get the ball of Jack. I think you've got to take a chance there. You could, go, you could get, if you get that one, you could get both. 
even if you get the jack. Just stop in there, let the, the guys explain what's going on. Alex Marshall asking to get into it with weight. Down, Paul, down a touch. Oh, that was so close. That should touch the ball. Got the single, but uh, didn't get the shot ball. Great try, mate. <clears throat> Great try, mate. Should be down the same, same as Paul. Close. Just the ball, mate. Just the ball. Very good. Oh, played that well, didn't he? Kind of the ball only was calling all the way. Didn't want the jack. Similar thing. Yes, mate. We've got live ball in the ditch. Was saying that it's a green ball in the ditch. So, uh, next looking for the jack if we can get it. Let's move a touch. Good enough. It is good enough because uh, it's going to stay on the rink by the looks of it, only just, and that's going to be very difficult now. Narrow side in the backhand is going to be. Probably necessary. Forehand draw. <laughs> good, good thing I should like. <laughs> I don't think I was too keen on this one. Just a draw. Tell me how. <laughs> yeah, go underneath me. Having to play across the carpet. Nick, I don't want to look at it, it doesn't look very good. Come on, mate. Well, it's perfect. Right. No. You need to try and cover the bowl in a way as well. It looked easy, but it wasn't. It was difficult to know to come off that line, but he did play it down on a narrow line, but it just held. It'd be interesting to see what how many thirds. Stay four. No. Well, what they're looking at is the green bowl. Uh, just I'm almost in the middle of the picture. And that green ball I'm happy is there, and that's the that's the mind. one you want to get out. But is it really worth it? You know, that's that's the question. It's, um, that's the key ball because there's other red balls that could count if that disappears. I'm not really too sure about this one to be truthful with you. You could draw another one for two. 
Mm -hmm. Certainly looks a lot easier. Mm -hmm. All depends if it just brings in how many brings in. Yep. Well, it's the last ball of the end, and that's why they're thinking about it so much. Well, if it brings in three more, definitely worth it. If it brings in two more, well, there's always a risk you might just flick it in for the shot. And it's only for the one more. Yeah. Only could stop as well, obviously. He's looking at it, walking down. I think he's going to be playing it. to bend. Oh, that one's going to go off the side of the rink, though. It's not going to count. It wasn't what he was after, but uh, he could easily have made a double. One shot, Foster and Marshall. It changes. Strange old end. Set score. Good morning, though, because it changed a lot. After five ends. Don't forget it. And that's the complexities of the pairs. Just off the confines of the ring. Jack minutes, 24 and a half metres. Sometimes when the guys hesitate like that, it's not a disturbance or anything else. Maybe there's the balls just slipped a little bit in their hand. A variety of reasons, so just take a, a few seconds reset themselves. Yeah. And again, keep rolling. Keep rolling. And again. And again, yeah, decent. Well done. Once again, Harlow getting in the first ball. Easy in now. Sell on, mate. Settle now. Play Paul, well done. So. Five inches, that's all you oh, need. Back down, in Northern Ireland. Just bring you up to date with this match. The first set, Nick Brett, Greg Harlow, 10 6. But the second set, well, it's been even all the way. Three each after five ends. And this is the sort of bowling we've been enjoying for most of the match. Shot again? No, no, got one. Can it, be, can it be turned off? No. Sorry? Can it be turned off? I don't think so, but the way Nick is playing, you probably could. <laughs> <laughs> Totally green one. I think you've just got a it yep. can squeeze. I think you can only give it away there. If you touch the jack at all, it's going to bounce off the back of your one. No, I'm not playing that then.
put one on the spot. If you're not sure what to do, at least make your ball valuable. I'm not sure how close Paul will be able to get to go that with way. his. Yep. <clears throat> Backhand. Yeah. Sensible thing to do. More chance of being able to scoot across Keep running. from the middle Hello line in towards the respot. You'll see yeah, it as it comes into our picture. You can draw into your own. Not quite, so he's or a bit short of it. it here. Doesn't matter, whichever you fancy. That's just a good pace just to sit or something around. Marshall's referring back to a moment ago about the way Nicky's playing and his playing. Well, there's no doubt about that. He's, he's very, very solid. Not missing much at the moment. So the world final. That's that's what you need to do. Down to this one, Leo. That's yep. handy. Good. Well done. Yes. One red. That's okay. Well, that would indicate to you that uh, the expectation is that Nicky will get into this ball and move the jack. He hit it absolutely perfect. He just didn't have enough weight to carry the ball over once. Something else in the area. The directionally, he had it absolutely right. Yeah. 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 Very similar ball, mate. Too quick. Finish in there, I'll help. That helps. It's not bad where it's finished. Could squeeze right there. Yeah, it's, a, it's a good head, good position for Nick and Greg. It's not an easy shot for Alex, it. He sort of needs another one in there, but it's very easy to give away as well. It's not blocking the way, and again, it's not easy, but a good crunch on the jack. If he gets the high side of the jack, the wide side of it, there's a chance it might scoot across to the right hand side of the picture. The other side of the jack, well, if it goes over there, he's got a chance of two green. But it's all about connection. Yeah, it's that, just that hard weight as well to play into it. Might be out there. Okay, mate. No worries. Yep. Just outside it. One. One shot. Foster and Marshall. <laughs> Set score four three after six ends.
Chart length 24 metres. Then yeah, mate. Right back. Right back. Well played. Good start. It's half to me, so it shouldn't stop you. Good tussle between these two players. Really good tussle. Yeah, Paul and Alex are grinding the way back into this. Oh, you got. Okay, mate. <coughs> Fine. That's a rare short ball. Gives Paul Foster an opportunity. Sail in now, Paul. Sail in. Excellent. Well played. Good. Oh, you're running now. Oh, you're running. And again. And again. And again. And again. Yeah. Good. Come again. Mm, thought that was all. Yeah, going to be a last one. On the short side. Well, but he was more keen to get rid of it on the tight side, to be honest, because he didn't want that blocking the way into the red ball. Yeah, hasn't finished great. Great there. Look to try and get inside his own. All right. Just over the top. That's fine. Yep, still there. Still there, Nick. I would, mate. Find a foot, you're perfect. Longer the hold, the better. Too red. It's a positive draw for Alex here. Can get a little turn on the jack. Good, but you just haven't pushed through it. Do you think, mate? Okay, mate. Ah. Yep. Get down. Get down. Oh, well, he's trying to get down. It means get down off a high line and just bend, really. And, well, it's dropped on the high side, dropped out. It's a catch, but uh, they could be looking to draw the shot. Still out there, I think. Quick, Sorry. Can I think? Yeah. Yeah. Missed it. Oh, I mean, I I wouldn't change anything, I'd be a fine one. Come on, mate. Oh, 
Pasqua Downs a chance here. Any touch in the jack, you're looking at, well, four, maybe five shots. Two hours now. Uh, two yards, my lad. Sort of expected Hang this on, match man. to go to about 220, maybe even two and a half, because uh, it is a final. I don't fancy anything else. A bit of discussion like going on. Potential for a, a tiebreak. Not really. Not after the first one. <laughs> going down to have a look. And, you know, these are sort of things that it's all green. part of the pair's game, of course. Yeah. And um, I really should just be drawing this. It's up to you. If you fancy the draw, no, I don't know. I've just played it badly. <laughs> Is it three down? Yeah, if you draw a second, yeah. You're right, you? Last ball was heavy, and he, he, knew he, was, he, he knew he hadn't played it well, so he recognises that. It's not that the shot's not there, Rob, it is there. Yeah, it's the way that hand's playing as well at the moment um, this year. If you just up, it just doesn't get down, it just uh, slips by. And on that wider line as well. So he might be tempted to have a, yep. have a go down at this. Yep, Should be the backhand draw, really. Well, this is an interesting choice of shot. He's looking for a ball on the jack. I can understand why he played it. It was a hard draw, and he reckoned if he could get the ball on the jack, he two, was getting three. Two, mate. Well done. Oh. Two shots. <laughs> two shots, Foster and Marshall. Set score, 6-3 after seven ends. So, two shots to Foster and Marshall. 6-3, two ends to go. Jack Lentz, 23 and a half metres. Your time. Short jack length, three shots in front, makes sense. Yeah, I mean, they started to find these short jacks slightly better now. Paul and Alex, um, similar to the first set, really. It's now two must-win ends for, for Nick and Greg. Touch up, Paul. There for <coughs> start. Right in. Well played. When you're 
three down, that's just about as good as it gets, isn't it? Yeah, as an opener. Oh, you can't play two better opening balls than that. They're both very near touching. Mm. So balls from the ball must look look ugly down there as well. I think about a better chance there. Just just over the draw. Just a draw. Any contact on the front green one pushes the jack out. It's a hard shot a too, bit, isn't it? As well. So you can just widen it as well. Yeah. Just stay in the in the pitch or widen it. And give Alex a chance. Even at this distance, you still have to punch the ball out Hurry. in a wide line. Hurry, Paul. Hurry. Has he got the weight to carry it, though? Yeah. And Keep that's running. not going to help. You can get to this one, mate. He's falling back on his other one. That plant part. is going he away from real it. Good. Run all you got now. Well done. We're all right. Sorry about that. Come on. Come on. Well, sensible ball. It's a really good position to be in. On the first set, three down, you're lying two. Even going into the next end, one down is still a good position. Target area. Yes, indeed. See Nick delivering and Judy Potter just in the background with John Potter watching this final. Big support. Thanks, mate. Very good. And that's a good cover ball. Oh, he's interested in this one. Still two, but he's given himself a chance. The last ball pass. Still two, mate. Last ball. Yeah. Pretty much Jack Hyde. You were... Uh, two feet. Possibly a touch less than that. Okay. We might give this a little chance here because uh, even Eden drawing right up to the jack and crunching it, it's good. To touch. Well, that's actually not bad there, Rob. You know that's um, that narrows the target down quite considerably. Alex well, well, could be tempted to run at the last bowl. Gets the yeah. top edge. <laughs> Into the green. <laughs> So oh, it's a bit of a yeah it's a tough one the backhand draw ball. there's a little touch on the ball you can see his foot it. just down at it and it's conceivable to play it that yeah, way ah. forehand shots a bit more speculative yeah no it's i'm not saying i'm just saying if you get the corner what he's looking at here is just to try and get past him onto the ball. The jack will just, just move just a little bit. The other alternative, if he wants, if he wants to play it, it's really not easy. Just to come in on the forehand, but again, there's no guarantees coming in there and crunching onto that jack and moving it across. That won't work either. And you're still going to be one, maybe two down. I, I just, I really don't like the look of this for Alex. It's, there's nothing easy about it. Front ball into something is possible, but very dangerous. It's with the score as well. It doesn't matter if it's a two or a three, really, they yeah. drop. Yeah. I yeah. still need to win the last end, so. Yep. Yeah, I 
That's why I think it's a backhand draw. I was walking down on the forehand side, just trying to get the angles. and get a connection. Front ball's the problem though. He doesn't want the green. Oh, that's exactly what he didn't want. That, oh dear. Well, if it's three, it's fine. No, it looks like three, but. I think that's close to being in. I mean, if it is, it could, this is a massive ball from Nick then. It is three, and if he gets this one in, Picking up a four here is it's huge in the context of the game. Well, the Foster Marshall combination still have to win, but as you said, Rob, two or three, it really doesn't make any difference. They have to win the next end. But if it's four, if you can add another, then. You know, it's a, it's a little bit of leeway, let's put it that way. You get four out of it, you can afford to lose a single. That's a great try, mate. <laughs> That's a great try, mate. I can't blame you, Greg, because. You know, you're looking at, he must favour that it's three if he's short. Two green, measure for third. Yeah, yeah, yeah. OK. If it's two shots, then... Six five. Still have to win the end. Doesn't necessarily make much difference this time. You've got to go down anyway. So it's three or two, it doesn't matter. Yeah. <coughs> It's a tight end on the last end, but it's, it's rare. Two touching balls would be the usual way if that's the case. It is rare. Three shots, Harlow and Brett. If you're going to smack another one in the front, but. Set score 6 6 after eight ends. Uh, one and shoot out here. Yes, one for the championship, one for the tie break. Lang and Jack, 27 and a half metres. And if you think they're heavy, I can assure you they very much are. few times in this match more than normal for all the players very difficult to have a crowd of this size Rob where they're not going to get coughing and movement and things like that so not easy Ready. Steady for right back. The crowd to, to be Steady for right back. Quiet. Steady. Well done. Have a piece of point of having background music. I think the players would prefer that, to be honest. A little bit of music in there. Then the problem would be what type of music? Definitely not yours. Definitely yes. not. Absolutely. Thank you. 
I put my music on the card just to annoy the guys when we're going to matches. You're not that fond of Caruso, believe me. Decent, well done, well done. Yep. Anything behind the jack's good there. Just sit the ball and drop it down, is good. Mm. Hanging on. You really would have made jack high. Yeah, it's pretty close. We just sneak it, I think, but with my eyes, it could be two down. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's not good at looking at things. He really admits that. Not up at the level of Andy Thompson, of course. Oh, yeah. Best eyes on the tour. Absolutely. Young Andy. Be right with us. And down, and down, and down. Oh. Oh, he just needed a touch. That was all to tuck that ball in. And it would have been so much more difficult. Hi, mate. Well done. Well done. Definitely not against me. Just try and set the ball and drop in. Drop, Paul. Right by. Right by. He's very close. Well, I think he's has he got the shot. Ball dropped back. I think he might have the shot. But it could have been so much better if he'd have dropped inside it. Oh dear. Okay. But that is. It makes zero difference. Zero difference, mate. Bit of an up. That's not a mistake. On this end, one. I mean, that's six fantastic bowls. Yeah, yeah, you're, you're right, mate. It's probably break. one down. Yeah. Fine, I'll cover with the first thing. Okay, mate. Okay. <laughs> Yep. He knew he was heavy, so he decided the cover ball would do. Oh, he's surely be on the forehand here to drop onto the, the green one, Rob. Yeah, definitely. It's a nice draw in hand this year. That forehand, so he'll get back easy to the green. Get back. Get back. He'll get back here. Get back, Tuck. Great shot. Yes, mate. And he's going to drop as well. And a little touch on the jack. A good measure. Probably makes a three out of it. I'm happy just to go quick. OK. Yep, just that little nibble. Before I'm quick into the plant for Nick. Touch. It's just inside. Yeah. Oh, it's it's all. Oh. <laughs> all the back position. It's finished well. That's not far from the spot, that one. Yeah. It could go anywhere. It could bounce about in there. It could go that way. It could go that it's, way. It's the front wall. <laughs> the plant will probably take the jack away at an angle. It's coming off this. That's what you're looking at, yeah. It's coming up at a slight angle. Francis, can I have a look? Sorry. Good, yes. good try, mate. That's good etiquette. Alex has remembered to ask permission to come up before 
He plays a second ball. Yeah. At this stage in the match, it'd be pretty harsh to say no. In the lap of the gods, isn't it? Skips aren't normally allowed up until after they've played their second delivery. But you can see the problem. You know, as Paul says, it, it could pinball around the, the green ones and stay in there. But all the green position is at the back. There's two more behind that. Mm. I think he has to just run for cover and try and make it useful or valuable. Mm. Out wide. Bring it right back. Hope that he's finishing in the right place. Oh. Two red. Who's to know where it's going to go? All depends if what contact he gets on the front red. Just inside the red balls. Two shots in the second set. Foster and Marshall match tie break. Well, that's what we thought would happen in this match. We'd go all the way to tie break. Exactly what we've now got. Good reflection on the game. Yeah, certainly deserve to say. Nicky, yeah, Nicky and Greg certainly deserve the first set. The first couple there. Immense out there. As I heard, uh, Nicky. And Don't Paul and Alex have fought their way back into the second set. I'll let match. you know when he comes back. Um, with good solid display <laughs> and certainly deserve this tie break. Paul won the toss and has given the jack to Greg on the first end. <laughs> if he's coming back. When they go, they go, don't they? Yeah. It's all about the toss of the coin on this uh, for options, whether to take the jack or leave it. And um, Paul Foster's won the toss, so he's decided to give the jack away to the green team. So they get the opportunity to put the jack where they want. And uh, Alex Marshall will have the last ball. Greg, just get a little clap. Where are you like, mate? Okay. Especially when everybody knows where you've been. Hmm? Jack length, 26 and a half metres. Decent, 18. <clears throat> Good call. Pass the front stuff. Just pass it. Not too bad. Probably there now, mate. They're right in the line. So, tie break, three ends. Just have to win the end, and that's enough. No accumulated shots, <laughs> the case in some other events. Right Not up, on good. Board balls tour. And again. You just have to win the end. And again. And again. And a 
2 1 or 2 0. And of course, in the last end, you've got the option to nominate Austin's to kill shot. the end and play it over again in the same direction. What do you, what does it look like from down there? Either, either you play something similar or you drop there, or you want to play for the jack, I'm happy. Up to you. Can I get, can I get back there on the back? You'll get the shot, you can draw it. Yeah, you'll get to here, drawing. Paul still is very Be confident. Keen to draw you it. play what shot you want to play. You pick it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's always nice when the skip says, "Well, whatever you can see, you play it." Rob, because shot it's in, probably on the forehand. I'm happy either hand, any hand. Right. Okay. Look. Well, the thing is, about touching that green one up, then at the centre of the rank, right. you were near enough perfect for your last one. The only danger there is in the forehand, you're just punching that green ball closer. Yeah, the ball's wide swinging bowls, you'll get round his easy on that hand well, as well. I, I think he will as well, to be honest with you. It needs to be about a foot jack high. Whoa. It's all about pace just on this. Just a touch, I think. Whoa. That's all. It's just over it's it fraction, slightly. Not much. not much. Just that. You take a foot off that, you'll draw the shot. Play the jack. Yeah, run the jack through. You're not, you can try, try and you have to drop around that red one now. Right, a few chances there. Mm -hmm. When you get green onto green, or if you're a bit na narrower, some of these short ones coming in. On this side? Or the back? And you, go, you can go clean, clean right through with the jack on the forehand. Sounds like the right option, doesn't it? You know, forehand, you've got a clean road if you're able to middle the jack. Now well, let's see what happens. It's all right, it's a lot better. Well, that certainly is a lot better. He's a bit narrow, but he's cleared all the debris away. It's a, it's a cleaner opportunity now. Well, I was just getting this line string out. See if one of Paul's bowls was in the rink. This could be crucial, this one, actually, because one of Paul's back bowls finished near the spot. So if the jack went kill, was killed, it was put back on the re-spot. That bowl would almost be right in the line to get there. Yes, they've done away with a telescopic sight, and uh, and they're now using just a line. It, it's old, it's old school, but it works. And then you're able to work on the uh, T square after that. Telescopic sight's good, but um, that works. Laser would work as well. Interesting choice of shot. Yeah, just leaving it alone. Just trying to win the respot, I think. Should be drawing this. Okay. Oh, not much, mate. 
18 inches. Eighteen inches gets you. Baba. Not sure. Probably not. No. No. One. Unusual, to say the least. Crucial ball from Nick here. If you can put one right on top. You always feel he needs a closer ball. He's on a great road. Great road. Played this pretty well. Just eases in. Yeah. Didn't want to touch the jack really because that would have uh, created a big, bigger target. For a second, it's more like attempt to this down the four. One green. Sorry, three shockers again. Oh, I don't think. Well, I've had a good enough track, but it's missing. Yeah? I think the problem for uh, Alex is, is if he gets the green ball, will he get the edge of the jack? Um, if, if, if you get, if it's solid, I think it's worth it, to be absolutely honest with you. I really do. You know, it's uh, it's an opportunity to play the weight. Plenty of chance down there, even if he gets the corner of the corner edge of the jack. Yep. You know, it's, it's it's one of those things where he's had two goals at the draw, just dropped a bit short. So. Um, Someone of Alex Marshall's quality, you're just thinking, he can take that ball. Just a bit on the right side. First end, Harlow and Brett. Hello, Brett. Now, Nick's got last bowl, so I have a bowl to win the, the championship. Jack, length 27 metres. back now all the way back all the way back <laughs> oh, Jack high ball close but it's never great and a, and a tie break end to bite Pulling in. Yep. That's the reason why I just use it for a shoulder. Drop off it. Shut 
traction. That is all. I'd keep the track with that. Got one minute. Two hours, 35 minutes, the longest game so far, as would be expected at the final. And such like a tight is. game as well, Rob, because there's been a lot to discuss yeah. for the players. <clears throat> Even thinking of it coming. Yeah, definitely. That's how you get the two extra ends in each set. It's half to go so, out without not know, getting, getting the green a one. A slightly longer game. I'll say with the tie break you as well. You can set up on any hand, but it may be worth maybe a good one. Two and a half to 250, probably. Near the one of the spots. Said before, the assumption is that you at can, this level, you can draw the this shot, quality just of player, the that yeah. and go one down. Well, your opponent's going to get it. Just if Greg does beat it, then I've got something. Well, I need a spot. Of. Yeah, go go that one there. Easy now. Yes, pretty good, Paul. Easy. Easy now. That's good. He's managed to run over the spot. He didn't even know where it was, really. Always taking a bit of a blind guess at that. through it because he didn't want to drop short oh, they couldn't afford to drop short one red this is them actually they're holding the shot but they don't really control the head here no it's not not easy for Alex I think it's almost coming down top side of the, right. the short green and just trying to squeeze past the the second bowl Be a brave shot on the forehand because he has to force it out wide. That's what he's playing. He knew out of the hand, and this is a concern. And in the end, it's actually not that bad. But he knew he wasn't reaching. It's leaving that trail on. Nick's certainly interested in this. He's stalking this one down. Oh, he's very close to getting the shot. Yes, he's got it. And that's exactly where Alex wanted that first ball of his to be. It was a hard place to put it. Two feet on your last. You've got that to drop, mate. Reaction. Looks like he's quick. The players always know. Case here for a blindside draw. Well, I don't know, even the forehand again because. If you turn it around the corner, it's going to, and you hide it. You don't want to be finishing the length and just giving no. something to sit off. That's the danger. Going down the blind side, yeah. around the front green. I think you'll be doing well to get within six or eight inches in the backhand. It's, uh, I think the problem is against Alex Marshall. <laughs> you don't really want to leave that. 
know, you want a, a good close ball, really good close ball. Going for the, the perfect delivery. You say, Rob, the only danger is leaving it on the wide side. He's keen. He's not far away. He's easy in now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm sure it's not going to return to Jack. He just got the wrong side of the Jack to hide it. It's still beatable, but it's going to take a tremendous goal under the pressure of a match lie against. But let's be honest about it. There's no better man in the world to have a go at this. He's done this a few times in his career. <laughs> he has, exactly. You know, and I've, I've witnessed it as well. <laughs> I think the two lads have done as much as they can possibly do under the circumstances. Once again, Nicky Brett getting in with two balls. He's been outstanding in this game. Definitely been the player of the match. For them. They've all played great bowls, but say Nicky's just been. Outstanding. Thank you. Times. Just settle down. Thank you. Just need 10 or 15 seconds of silence just to let him play. Yeah. Well, he's called it better from hand when he's on the, on the run. Up, yeah. If he's up, he's very close. If he's up, he's very close. Oh, look at that. That's what he does. That is what he does. You know, we've seen it so often. He's one of the very few players in the world where you're three inches away, you think to yourself, I haven't won this yet. And he's straight from hand, he said better, so... It's a worrying sign for, for Nick and Greg when he's called that. And as soon as he was getting any anything close to the green ball, Paul knew he was getting the shot. Forearm run, chip the ball, get it on the jack, it could go anywhere. Psyched up. That's what we should be. It's a world final. If you can't get up for that, then... Next running the ball, is he? Yep, he's trying for the edge. Now, Nick. Are you getting back oh, to the he's red? Close. He's close. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Third end coming up. Usual handshake between the players when it comes to the last end of the tie break. Oh my goodness me. He can't keep doing it, can he? Year after year in different competitions. Got to give someone a chance sometime, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> brilliant stuff, though. Brilliant stuff. We love it. And so does everybody watching. Jack, no, that's 27 metres. Uh, advantage back with Foster and Marshall once again. Of the coin so important, isn't it? Because you're able to give the jack away the first end and the third end. That gives your, your skip the last ball. And that ball just slipped a little bit. change a little bit again in in this end on the third end of the tie break uh, both pairs can nominate to kill the end 
Yes. Uh, the only important thing is that they, they can yeah, nominate right. as often as they wish. Right. You want another two? That's only when it's successful. But the rules change. a little bit nervy end as well that's uh, not unusual for it to be a little bit loose no let's put it that way yeah it's the out we've oh, spawned it oh he's got it solid oh dear From the Indian track, to get any closer good weight as well just needed a little bit of uh, width on the ball the red one We better leaving that red ball as it is and just playing the other side. You know, it's um <laughs> the backhand just doesn't look that great, so move on to the forehand. More options. Should be very close to a three hour match. <coughs> Run now. Run! Just have to hurry to get in front of the other red one. Oh, not beside it. Well, that's not bad. It's not ideal. Because the two balls will go. I think Paul will be tempted Ball, to play this. Paul, off it. Inside edge of his own, he gets the two greens. You'll draw that. <clears throat> yeah, one, draw the shot. It's drawable. I think the good thing about drawing it, Rob, is that if he is drawing it, it's going to be hidden behind the green ones. Yeah. Oh, that is very wide. <coughs> Even for Paul's ball. Three, three, two. Yeah. It was always on the high side. Sorry. <coughs> Full drawing from the care. All right. Responding to the same one. Not spotting up. Oh, good for a back touch here. Mmm. Absolutely. Even if he pulls a jack back to the back one, it's good. Clap from Greg. There's a bit of a grimace from Nick Brett because he knows it's not ideal sitting there. You're not going to be with that one, mate. He just walked <laughs> off the green wall. Alex's bowls in. Mm. It's great the players at this final end of a, of a World Championship still have a, uh, have a bit of a laugh. They do, but did finish Jack. Hi, yeah. Uh, no, it's just, just past. You know, it's, it's major respect out there because you've got for the very best. Ooh. Paddy. So he pushed it. Oh. What a look to waste. Well, Paul was, was shouting to hurry, oh. so he was on a perfect oh, line. Enough. He wants to dip out of the way now. Oh, no. That, that is not good where that's finished. Time again, mate. Yeah. We'll get round there quite easily this week. Yeah. Nick can play. Similar, land his bowl. Well, let's see what the options are here. Down the forehand, it's um, yes, anything really, Rob. I'm happy with that. You know, from there to there, any and anything in that distance is good. Yeah. Because getting in the front end of the of that. Um, Arrow is a, is a useful ball that's going to force Alex into playing weight. 
Well, he's not even bothering. He's going in the backhand to try and secure for the race ball. a positional ball. He must be thinking, oh, this is going to hit this. Hmm? Well, but I don't know. It's not bad. It has value. There's no doubt about that. It's always the value. But there's a plant on for the three green balls. Yeah, I'm not sure if the back one beats the front reds or not. Probably does, but it opens up the door. No, no problem. I've got no problem with that. No way, that's the wine coming in. Mm -hmm. They might nominate here as well. I, I just can't see where they're going to get the jack off. Catches the, the green top side. It could make an angle. It, it, it might make an angle, yeah. Because there's yeah. a distance between the two holes. It's not great. I'm dead weight. I'll get down. I'll get past that. Hold it, when you go. <clears throat> it's, it's never going to be easy to get into that side of it, Rob. That's that's yeah. the top side you're talking about. It forces the green ball into the jack, but um, even if he hits <clears throat> it solid, I think all three balls will disappear. I think he's going down the forehand draw. Well, the forehand draw is the perfect ball. That's... If he draws it, it's pretty much a match ball. It is, it is, absolutely. <laughs> if he draws this. Oh, dear. He'll be a brave man to bet against it as well. Not sure. From the facial expression, he's not sure, which means he's heavy. Because the yeah. line's OK. Yep. Just watch that ball getting all the way back into centre rink. So that just proves that the line is good. But uh, he was over the weight. Again, what do you do? Players do get frustrated sometimes when they know they're playing a big ball and just occasionally things uh, can slip out of their minds, but uh, Anybody's offended? I've always been set. Apology for that. That wee bit weight, you dropped the shot running through. It's tough out there. It really is. What's Nicky playing here? Still down the backhand. Probably just inside his last. I think he might even go for a, a closer ball, but um, just try and get past the <coughs> jack if we can. Cool. Draw it dead. Yep, that's what he's trying for, and it's a good ball as well. Uh, yep, you know, that, that absolutely stops that, uh, that running ball because there's no way you're going to get all those things out. No chance. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's committing himself now, Alex, after his, after yeah, his yeah. second. It's a draw, that's it. That's a good ball where he's put that because of this. Jack bounces at all, it's going to... Be absolute dead pace. I don't think he'll get back with any any pace. This is, this is tough. Ball of the match. Ah, well, he doesn't like it. Out of the hand. Sorry, mate. Sorry. Right. No play, please. Well done. Excellent. No play. Thanks. Well done. Well knew it was just on the high side, and uh, the ball is just not getting back in time. But then you got a big edge there, there actually. Uh, 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 watching it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It was always possible, but uh, a really, really great game of balls, I have to say. Fantastic final. Greg Harlow, Nicky Brett for the second time. Paul Foster, Alex Marshall pushed them all the way, winning the second set. 8 6, but lost out in the tie break eventually. Two shots to three ends to one. Really good performance by all four players, Rob. Yeah, all four played exceptionally well today, as you'd expect from these four on the carpet. Um, but Nicky, the outstanding player out of the four today, played some absolutely fantastic bowls to both sets and fully deserves the win. Absolutely. First set in particular, they were unbelievably good. And Nicky Brett in particular was outstanding of the four players. But they all played very well. That's the point. They all played well.
And the thing is that they set themselves very high standards as well, you know, if they're not perfect. But we said at the start it was going to be a good match. And that's exactly what it proved to be. Nicky Brett just getting a little fortune there early in the match. But then he played the big balls and that one took the jack through and all the way through to the ditch. Ball on the ball and then the follow through, but didn't carry the luck that time, Alex Marshall. Nick Brett showing that he can play the perfect ball as well. And Alex Marshall looking to get a little bit fortunate, but it didn't happen. And it doesn't always go your own way, Nick. Sometimes it just goes against you, and it did when he lost that one to lose the second set. Uh, Alex Marshall showing just how well he can draw. Plays the big balls, no doubt about that. And that was a match lie against him, and he played it again. What a fantastic delivery to save the game. But Nick Brett adding another shot in. And in the end, Alex Marshall couldn't beat it. And it's the English pair that win the world pairs. Greg Harlow, Nicky Brett, victorious. Ends one, well, there you go, look at that, 10, 11. Total shot scored, 14, 16, touchers, 16, 12. You know, and, and the average jack length even the same because they didn't want to change it too much during the match, but it was a fantastic pairs game. It really was. So little between the, the two pairs. And all you can say is that one ball here or there really would get in, would win the championship, and that's exactly what happened. So well done to Greg Harlow and Nicky Brett. four of the best players in the world you are likely to have a very close match and a wonderful match it was as well uh, we'll speak to Alex first of all uh, obviously it's, it's painful to be on the losing side but I guess the consolation is it was a very entertaining match and a, a good one to be involved in yeah it was a fantastic final I thought it's what a performance Nick and, and uh, Greg put forward today I thought they were, they were a master class from start to finish I thought the first three or four ends in the first set we kind of dominated, but Nicky had a few good runners and got good results. But after that, they were just phenomenal. Uh, I don't think myself and Paul played too badly, to be fair. But uh, congrats to the guys who played drawing. And Paul, just hearing the crowd, I mean, the atmosphere as well and the spirit between the four players is something that's unique. Yeah, as if I think everybody would think before the game started, four of the best players in the world are going to have a, a cracking game. But I'm just going to reiterate what Alex says. Um, apart from the first two or three ends, um, Nicky was absolutely outstanding, and, and as was Greg. And to be honest, we, we hung in, managed to take a to a tie break, and anything can happen. But uh, I would worthy winners, definitely. Absolutely, well said indeed. Uh, Greg, you, you, you do a little bit of commentary, don't you? And we're just going to ask you to commentate on the bowl that Nicky produced in the first set in the seventh end, <laughs> if you don't mind. It was, it was pretty special. We've got it on, on, on camera for you. Okay, I can, I can say there were so many special balls by, by all four of he, us. He did, I can't you, you were on fire remember today. which one. Okay, I, I can't remember on. which one. Oh, this one. Oh, absolutely. There literally was one road in with an inch to spare and probably the best bowl of the match. Absolutely. It had everybody... It absolute raptures about that. I mean, that must have been a special moment. I know the, there was still a lot of the match to go, but that was that was superb. Just hit my leg in the right spot. <laughs> <laughs> you did that a few times, mate. Yeah. <laughs> you were hitting your leg a lot today, then. Yeah. Well, to be fair, you, you can't come to the world final against these two players and play average because that doesn't get the job done because a number of other people have tried and not gone away very well. Greg, it's a great team effort. I mean, to get the better of the two guys standing next to you at any point is a pretty special feeling. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, obviously, we've played many times in many different formats. And um, today, I never felt safe at any point. Every end, as well, long as one of the guys had a bowl left, you, you know, as Alex proved on the second last end, you know, probably nine times out of 10 or even 49 out of 50, that would have been enough to win the tournament. He's, and he's drawn a fantastic bowl. 
and I'm thinking, is he going to do it once more? Because he's done it hundreds of times before. And I'm just thinking, please, just for once, just for once, <laughs> let, let us off. <laughs> uh, Nick, you guys won it in 2014. You lost it to Paul and, uh, and Alex last year. How good does it feel to get your hands back on the trophy again? Obviously, it feel, it's nothing, nothing better winning a world title against two of the best players in the game who have won everything. And it's just nice that they let us have a go this time round. <laughs> and on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I give you your 2020 Pairs champions, Greg Harlow and Nicky Brett. Cheers, guys. to our presentation party from the Just Group Communications Director. Please give it up for Steve Lowe and the Managing Director of Potter's Resort, John Potter. We're now going to welcome Dan. They did a fantastic job. Welcome, Dan. Your runners-up, Paul Foster and Alex Marshall. And your 2020 World Bowls Open Pairs champions, Greg Harlow and Nick Brett. One more time, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for your champions, Craig Harlow and Nick Brett. Well, there we are, live from Podders. What a match.